The Federal Reserve System, often referred to as the Fed, is the central bank of the United States. Some sources argue that the Fed is the most powerful financial institution in the world. It was created on December 23, 1913, with the authorization of the Federal Reserve Act. This act came in based on the desire for central control of the monetary system and to relieve financial crisis. The Fed is made of 12 regional Federal Reserve Banks. Each of these banks are responsible for a specific geographic area of the U.S. Collectively, the Fed aims to provide the country with a reliable and steady monetary and financial system. The Fed's main duties include regulating national monetary policy, supervising and regulating banks, maintaining financial stability, and providing banking services. The Fed also influences the aggregate demand, which is a measure of the total consumption of goods and services over any period of time. The Fed can typically increase aggregate demand by lowering interest rates. When it lowers interest rates, asset prices climb. Value increase of assets such as homes boost confidence among consumers, leading to purchases of larger items and improving the overall spending levels. For a matter of fact, and in the current situation, the Fed has also decreased the interest rates into near zero, with high hopes to stimulate the economy. Due to the current events of the COVID-19 pandemic, businesses closed their doors, events were cancelled, and countless professionals had to work from home, or were even let go. This triggered a deep economic downturn, which is still daunting the US. The Fed stepped in to curb the influence of the pandemic's economic damage through lending $2.3 trillion to support households, employers, financial markets, and state and local governments. This support is unprecedented and is supposed to put the US economy on the road of recovery. Nonetheless, it is only time that will tell us the effect and validity of the Fed's strategy to set the US economy back on track.